Hey guys, it's operations time. We're gonna be playing in the yard today, doing some yard classification. We got a long train that came in on the hauler. You can see the hauler sitting there getting uh, sanded, number 9710 right there in the foreground. And uh, we got like 11 cars we got to classify here. We're gonna be going to a whole bunch of different industries out on the layout. And I uh, got a little surprise here for you. We uh, figured, hey, you know what? Uh, last time I was over at uh, West Colton, a UP yard there. Uh, they actually use three uh, consisted together uh, GP40 2s as their yard switchers, uh, all three of them. So uh, we got we got three haulers over. No, sorry, three haulers. We got three yard engines over here. We got the uh, GP39-2. Uh, we got the GP38-2 and the GP15-1. All consisted together over here. Let's get them fired up. And we're going to be doing some uh, classification with the three of them. All right, looks so like we had a good start on all three. They're all warmed up. Let's move on out. So first up, uh, we got a couple of cars that came in on uh, one of the other locals there in the background. Uh, the yellow box car in the Santa Fe. You just see the tops of them there. We're gonna grab those and put them on the departure track. We'll head out the uh, south side over here. This is where most of our uh, classification work gets done. We'll drop back in uh, to track one, grab those two uh, box cars, and then, like I said, we'll come back and uh, drop them off with the rest of the uh, departures. sound good together. Right, we got our two cars there. We'll pull those suckers out. Now for the rest of the cars that are going to be getting classified, um, I've already used my little dice roll method where I roll the dice to determine where the cars are going to be going. I've got that uh, written down on my clipboard here, so uh, we're all ready to roll here as soon as we get these guys out of the way. Turnout set.
gear is good, it's gonna disconnect it. Swing you over there so you can actually kind of see something. Just got him on the uh, back side of this here car. Next up, we're gonna grab our big long train of cars there. And we will get to work. All right, looks like we got a good connection. We'll pull them back and uh, start figuring out where to put these cars. All right, so the first car in the end over there is a uh, blue uh, CX car repurposed it there. That one's going to be going over to Shasta Beverage, so I think what we'll do is we'll start uh, start putting the cars all the way in the back, work our way forward here, so we'll start on track one, we'll drop that guy off. You'll see him at the uh, tail end right here. Got a bunch of tanker cars, or tank cars I should say. Now four of those are going into uh, our Titan transfer facility, so they'll be on the track all by themselves. One of the tank cars is actually going to uh, Shasta Beverage, that last one right there. Chlorine. I guess, uh, not sure what the Shasta Beverage uses it for, but they use chlorine for something. All right, track one it is. Now we're gonna shove all the way back to the uh, north side of the yard there, drop them off as far as we can on our track. And we should be able to get a better uh, view of the locomotives once we get rid of all these uh, tank cars.
right, so next car at the tail end of all these tank cars is our uh, gondola. That one's going to be uh, going out to Sanford and Son Salvage. Uh, I think what we're going to do is put that one on track three. Because uh, usually the, uh, the local that takes the... Uh, takes any cars down to Huntington Beach, uh, makes its way right past there. This one is going to Shasta Beverage. We'll throw him on uh, track one. tank cars here like I said they're gonna be going down to uh, Cerritos to the Titan transfer facility we'll put these guys on uh, track two all by themselves
Since we got rid of the uh, tank cars here, we got uh, two hoppers and two box cars. Now the hoppers are going to be going to uh, United Polymers. We'll figure out which train to place those guys on. And that'll do right there. So the two boxcars, like I said, they're going to be going over to uh, United Polymers. That's a trailing spur. Uh, we could probably put those on with the gondola. Uh, That'll go on the train that's heading down to Huntington Beach. The first stop it can do is right there in uh, Cerritos or La Mirada. Drop those two guys off. And then the last two boxcars, since they're uh, heading to Royal Plywood, right next to Shasta Beverage, that'll be one uh, local. So we'll drop these two boxcars off, along with the uh, boxcar and the and the tanker that's going to Shasta Beverage. And that'll do right there. We'll get these two boxcars on track one, and that'll be it for the classification here. any bells here and as you can tell I don't have these uh, consisted together with CVs so it sounds like uh, Santa Claus on a street corner about half a car to go And that will do.
pull into the uh, storage track here, or the parking track, I guess I'm not quite sure what it would be called. Shut them down and uh, call it a day. Guys, I hope you enjoyed that uh, little yard classification here. Hope you guys have a good weekend. Don't forget to hit the uh, thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button if you're new. Hit the bell button to get notified when I post new videos like this. All right, time to shut her down. Like I said, guys, have a good weekend and see you in the next video. Take care.